Danske Bank, still reeling from the fallout of Europe's biggest money laundering scandal, has a new chief financial officer. Now, it's a name that will be familiar to those who follow European banks. Stefan Engels has served as CFO of Commerzbank since 2012. Danske's CFO, Christian Balzer, will leave Denmark's biggest bank. So let's get more now with Bloomberg Intelligence senior analyst. He's Philip Richards, who's in our London office. So, Philip, do the latest reshuffles at Danske suggest more difficulties at the troubled Danish bank? Morning. Uh, no, I don't think so. I think it's the case of um, Chris Vogelzang has come in as CEO just a couple of months ago, and he's kind of getting his own people on board. These people he knows from the market. Um, and as you mentioned earlier, there, um, um, the, the former CEO of Commerce Bank has been there now for seven years, um, Stefan Engel. So he's got experience. He's come in. Um, and so it's, I think it's more a case of Chris now coming in at Don Dansko and taking control of how he wants to take the bank going forward. Um, Phil, do you expect any change in strategy at Nordia with the new chief executive? Um, I, again, I, I think that is, is positive for them. I think when you've got the former CEO, Kasper von Kuskel, who said he's going to leave, he's going to retire, that takes away a lot of power from them. So I think anyone coming in for a start is the positive sign of that. Um, who they brought in, um, Frank, they, I think he's very well known. He's been a former CEO on the handles bank, banking side. So I think that's a positive. He's also worked on, particularly on, on the personal banking side and the retail aspect. And I think um, Nordea has got quite struggled down in terms of whole, whole, wholesale banking restructuring over the last two or three years, um, which has been Kasper. Sort of angle. I think we're now that now done. Actually, this could be a kind of a new new growth phase for them.